Hi. Hey. Hi. Hola. What's up? Today, we're back in my bathroom once again. I think the last time we were in my bathroom. Probably last summer. But we're gonna do the yearly dyeing of hair for the summer. Yeah, I don't really have like any inspiration on doing this, so we're just gonna kinda wing it. I bought two different hair dyes this time. I bought this Ion Brights Flamingo. This is like the lighter pink. And then the same brand, but in haughty pink. So it looks more purple-y. Since my hair is like brown or like my natural color and then it goes to blonde, it's gonna be a little difficult to do like a full head. I got this cap frosting slash tipping cap. Focus mainly on like the ends of my hair. So let's just get started. Crochet hook. There's a little visor. That's what it says. It's a visor. Uh, what the heck? Hey, that's cute. I guess what you're supposed to do is like, there's like little circles here and you like poke your needle. I don't even know. You poke your needle and put your hair out. Pretty sure. Where? Um, I like stick it through. Okay, so I'm just gonna do this. I'll be back, it's gonna take a while. Plastic all over your Okay, so here I am. I look like a creepy doll. So I finished, oh no, actually I didn't do like any of it basically. Trevor did all of it. Took a while, but now we're here. I'm gonna start with the light pink. mainly on like the ends and the small strands. This is what it looks like for now. I'll get back to you at, in 40 minutes. So the timer went off, so I'm gonna take this off and wash my hair. I don't even know how to take this off, honestly. Okay, my microphone wasn't even on, but um, I was saying that it's really subtle, obviously. I'm going to do some more tomorrow, but I'm not going to do any more tonight because it's like already 11 o'clock. So yeah, we will resume this later. Welcome back. It's day two, so it's currently two o'clock and I have to go to work at five. 
So hopefully I can do this in about three hours. So I haven't been ponytail this morning. It doesn't look too bad. It just, you can tell there's some pink in it. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but, but it's just not as much as I would like. I want it a little bit more vibrant. So I also have this Manic Panic Atomic Turquoise in here. I literally had this since I was in like sixth grade. So I think I'm gonna put a little bit of that in there as well. So what I'm gonna do, I'm not gonna use my cap again because that just took way, way too long. I'm going to do the underneath first. So I'm going to do this underneath part all pink. But once I saturate that, and then I'll focus on the top section. So the top part, I'm going to do streaks of pink and blue. Maybe I'll just do this everywhere because really it didn't, it didn't hold a lot of color. So maybe I'll just do this all over the underneath. And then when I'm done with that, I'll just take little sections, do little streaks, and I'll do little streaks of blue in it as well. I also have this, which is what I used last year, which was really, really pink. So maybe I'll add a little bit of this in it as well. I'm going to put some Vaseline on my neck, just so there's not a bunch of pink all over my neck. Okay, so I finished doing the underneath of my head. This is how I started last year. If you want to see the fail pink hair that I did last year, I'll, I'll try to link it down below if I remember. It was a fail. I'm going to take the pink that I took last year. It was really, really, really hot pink. Like, it looks like a red in the thing. And I'm just going to do the roots. I'm just going to blend it down. That's done. So I'm gonna take down my hair and I'm just gonna do one side at a time. I might even just do half of this. So you can kind of see the pink, not really. Cause I'm just gonna kind of wing it. Okay, so here's what my hair looks like right now. So it looks like a hot mess. I think I did something that I probably am gonna regret, which is put the blue on my scalp. I don't know why I did that. I'm just really hoping it's gonna come out when I wash it because the last time I used the blue was literally in like sixth grade, uh, maybe even before that, I don't even remember. It was a long time ago, but I didn't, bleach my hair or anything so it was my root color and so I put it on my roots so I'm hoping it's not going to stick it's just going to wash out so I'm going to keep this on for about 45 minutes so it's currently 320 so at like 410 ish I'm going to take a shower and wash it out okay guys so I put my hair in this like <laughs> uh, weird thing so I could do stuff but I just ate, it's been about 40 minutes. So I haven't taken a shower today. So I'm going to take a shower now. Hopefully it looks good. I'll get back to you guys when I'm out of the shower. Here we go, I'm taking the towel off. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay, don't look too bad. Yes, yeah, so the top. It looks green, but it will fade definitely by like the second wash. Um, so what I was going for, the look I was going for is mermaid. Some sort of summer vibe, you get what I'm saying? Um, so I'm gonna put some more this heat protectant in my hair. It's about to blow my hair dry. It's 4.37, so I have about 10-ish minutes. It definitely picked up a lot more color this time. Hopefully the black, the back doesn't look too bad. 
okay i don't hate it um the purple looks really purple this time around i like the hot pink i like the blue in it though let's blow it dry i guess pretty cool um i'm gonna curl it a little bit see if i can keep my curling iron up fast enough to curl it a little bit i think if i blend them together it'll look a lot better so i have about eight minutes i'm gonna go go put on my jeans wait for this to heat up and i'll be back to curl it in just a second okay i literally have to leave like now I'm just going to attempt to curl this. Alright, I gotta leave for work, so I'm not gonna end the video right now, but this is what my hair looks like so far right now. That's what it looks like for now.